It is the final weekend before the All-Star break. The Cleveland Guardians carry the best record in the American League into town. See if Taj Bradley can keep the ball in the yard. The youngster from Los Angeles struggled out of the game. Remember, began the season injured, but boy, has he been strong lately. The right-hander facing Stephen Kwan. And the base hit is delivered by Kwan down the left field line, cut off near the line by a Rosarena. And Stephen Kwan has now hit safely in 13 games. All 13 games he's played against Tampa Bay, he has a base hit. How about that? Here's the DH tonight. The youngster Angel Martinez batting left-handed. Martinez on the ground a second. Could be a double play ball. Richie Palacios, the flip to Taylor Walls, and the throw to first is in time to turn before 6 3 double play. And the Guardians have elected to challenge the out call. After review, the call on the field at second base, the out call is confirmed. The call at first base is overturned. The runner is safe. Cleveland will retain their challenge. Here is Jose Ramirez, switch hitter batting left handed. And Ramirez, a hot shot to second. It's caught on a line by Palacios. To go. I wonder if he could have short hopped that to turn two. Either way, he gets the out and there's two men away. For a guy having just a bang up year, Josh Naylor. Bradley strikes out Naylor. A hard splitter at 93, down and away. Takes care of Naylor and Cleveland turned away. Carlos Carrasco, who nearly made history in this ballpark, starts tonight for Cleveland. Carlos, 37 years of age, 6'4, 219. So one out walk brings up Randy Arena. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Two down. No score in the first for Isak Paredes. Here's the pitch. And it swung on. Popped him up. Foul ball. Third base side in the bullpen area. Jose Ramirez, the third baseman, makes the catch. John Kenzie Noel. He hits one on the ground in the hole. Diving backhanded. Stop by Walls. Throw to first. Not in time. Oh, my. What an effort by Walls. I'll tell you what, John Kenzie Noel got down that line a lot quicker than you might think for a big man. No score for Andre Jimenez. And here's Bradley's pitch. Got him swinging. And he went top of the zone with off speed. And Jimenez has struck out second K for Bradley. So he records his second strikeout. And now Daniel Schneeman. Bradley's pitch has swung on and missed strike three. Another splitter. And that was in the zone. He got him swinging on a pitch that would have been a cold strike. Again, Bradley's pitch. Swinging a high chopper towards second. Easy high hop. Shoulder high for Richie Palacios. And he throws him out at first to retire the side. Lead off infield single is all that Bradley allows. Here's Josh Lowe. He'll lead off the Tampa Bay second inning. He's hitting fifth, playing right field. Lowe swings and grounds one fair by the diving nailer and down the right field line. Long run for Noel. Lowe hits second base. Now he rounds it. He's going to try for third and wait a minute. No, he's going to go back to second and probably a good idea. It's a leadoff double for Josh Lowe. As well as he runs, he's going to score on any base hit to the outfield more than likely. So I, I agree. Smart move, and that's the first hit for the race. Low to third, but now two men are out. And here's the former Clevelander, Richie Palacios. A swing and a smash. Hit the bag at first. Up in the air, it ricochets. Naylor runs to the bag, beats Palacios. Oh, a bad bounce for the race. That ball directly hit the bag at first and Karam straight up in the air giving Naylor to catch it like a pop-up race to the bag and he just beat Palacios no score in this one we're in the third inning swing and a miss he got him off speed sharp cutter and that's four strikeouts already for Bradley no score third inning two down nobody on swinging a ball looped the other way to fairly deep left back of Rosarena toward the track under it just shy of the warning track and retired is Martinez it's a 1-2-3 for Bradley despite falling down in the count Carlos Carrasco in this scoreless third faces the number nine hitter catcher Alex Jackson swing to ground ball tore the hole at short Schneeman backhands from the outfield turf high throw and safe at first is Jackson on the Rays have a base runner to begin the third inning Jackson had been 0 for his last 25 one on none out 1-0 Yandy Diaz lines went in right. It's going to drop for a base hit. And it'll drop down right along the foul line. Jackson goes first to third. And the Rays have first and third. And nobody out in the scoreless game in the third. One ball, one strike on Brandon Lau. Lau grounds one to second. Jimenez pumps, throws to the back for one. And they'll turn the double play. But Tampa Bay gets a run home. Taj Bradley, as advertised, he's been tough so far. He'll face Jose Ramirez. Swing and a miss. He got him off speed. Good cutter from Bradley. 
And that's already his fifth strikeout in the first out in the fourth. Two up, two down. John Kenzie Noel will be the batter. But he strikes out here. Slow breaking ball in the dirt, blocked by Jackson. He fires to first to get Noel, and it's a 1 2 3 shutdown inning for Taj Bradley in the fourth. Josh Lowe wearing a mic for us here tonight. He leads off for Tampa Bay. <laughs> Finally broke the curse of not getting a hit on Apple TV tonight. <laughs> there you go. There you go. What curse? He has two hits tonight. Yeah, man, you got to give yourself more than one at bat. So two down for Richie Palacios. Palacios went to Towson University. Swung on, bounced back to the mound. Knocked down by Carrasco. Picks it up, throws to first in time for the out. And he escapes. Side retired. We head to the fifth. So a great chance here for the Guardians to tie or perhaps take the lead as they have a couple of men aboard. Austin Hedges, number nine hitter at the plate. Right on cue, chopped the third, cut off by Paredes, the second for one, and on the first for the 5 4 3 double play. And they're out of it, and they don't have to deal with Quan this inning. 9 1 and 2 do up for the Rays. Fifth major league season for Jackson. From the first base side of the rubber, Carrasco pitches, and a line drive sinking into left center field, and Alex Jackson's got himself a base hit towards the alley. He's going to try for second. Here comes the throw. He's got a double. Alex Jackson with a double to begin the Rays' fifth inning. On a two strike pitch, no less. Alex Jackson was ready for. Now you got to get this run home, Andy. I mean, man at second, not out. Hey, what? The Rays got the top of the order up. Diaz, Lau, and a Rosarena. And the pitch, slow roller, fair ball, that will score him. Down the right field line. Jackson around third, he scores. Diaz spinning and going to second base. And a head first dive, he's safe. Back to back doubles, and it's 2 0 Rays. He just kind of inside out of that, really squibbed it past the bag. And it rolled almost to a stop up the right field line. He was pretty excited to know that he hit one at 118 yesterday. Neil, that was hit at 65 miles per hour. Randy Rosarena will step in. Diaz comes off the bag, and there's a swing and a bouncer to short. Up with it, Schneeman fires home, and Hedges applies the tag on Diaz as he was coming down the line, and he's out at home plate. And there he goes, and the pitch is swung on and missed strike three. Paredes strikes out, side retired. Runner at second, two down. It's going to be David Fry. How about this? 2-2, two, two, struck him out. High fastball got him again. Taj Bradley gets his eighth punch out. So a double to center. Puts a runner at second. Two down in the eighth. Here's Yandy Diaz. Right-hander against right-hander. Curry's pitch. Swing and a liner to right. There's a four-hit game unless Noel gets there, and he makes a great diving catch. What a play by John Kenzie. Noel racing toward the line. Made a diving catch to Rob Diaz of an RBI hit. We head to the ninth. Jason Adam comes out of the bullpen. Called strike three. Naylor didn't have a chance. Here's a changeup. He, he throws it and notice the movement. It just locks him up. But so far, so good tonight. Five up, five down for the Tampa Bay pen, and the Guardians are down to their final out. So Adam has struck out Naylor and Noel. Last hope is Andre Simenez, 0 for 3. Got him swinging, and the ball game is over. Jason Adams strikes out the side in the ninth. The Tampa Bay bullpen fanning five of the six hitters they face, and the Rays with a hard-fought 2-0 victory over the Cleveland Guardians.